last time. I didn't know I was playing basketball. Fuck. Oh, fuck. <laughs> okay. Uh, thank you, box. And now. Yay. My journal is gone. What would they want with my journal? So he lost something, and now he's gone crazy. Woo. And I get to deal with him! Yay! <sighs> Nothing. 2nd of July, 1839. I received a letter today from the Algerian governor's office disclosing the fate of Herbert's expedition. About a week after my departure, Abdullah, one of the men traveling with us, returned from the desert. He was badly injured, as if maimed by a lion. The man rambled deliriously about the expedition being attacked by something horrible. The French quickly dispatched a search party to look for the expedition. After searching for days, they found the camp abandoned without any trace of Herbert or his men. Tomorrow, I'll retrieve the things they recovered from Herbert's tent at the customs house. I don't know what to make of it, but I'm worried for him. <coughs> yeah. Damn. So. Is anyone there? No. Please, I just, I don't want to deal with you. My head's fucking pounding. Apparently. Nothing. 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 Hey! It is something! 3rd of July, 1839. Today I picked up Herbert's things at the customs house. I dug through the trove of documents he had carried and found a log detailing the expedition. The nature of this text ranged from quick notes to colorful accounts of transpired events. I skimmed the pages trying to figure out what might have happened. May 17th, the day I was trapped inside the orb chamber, Herbert dryly states, recovered Daniel after one hour of entrapment. This confused me greatly. I was suffocating within minutes. How could I have lasted an hour? I continued reading the peculiar text. Herbert states his facts without judgment or passion, but suddenly I could read frustration into his text. He pushed his men to investigate the underground tomb, an effort which seems to have strained the minds of his men. Madness spread through the ranks, and Herbert had to take some extreme measures to continue. He finally visits the chamber himself, where he retrieves the orb to the surface. His account confuses me greatly. If he has the orb, what are those pieces in my drawing room? Uh-oh. Uh, is this my room? Uh, the lock broken. Find another way into... To open the closet door in the... Broken lock caused by some idiots, obviously. Look. Mm. Didn't mean to do that, but now I got a nice fire going. Who broke my favorite box? And my wine! Son of a bitch! You're all I got to die tonight! <laughs> That's my wine to break. This is my jar break! Mother 
motherfuckers. <laughs> Can I light this? Well, no. Oh, hello. Hmm. Ooh, oil. What? Hmm. Bam! Mm -hmm. I don't have to go out. Don't have a key. Um, wait. Ah, there we go. I was just gonna start trying random shit. Yes. Ah. The key. Please let it be here. Wait. Was I the one going crazy? An important key is hidden in this in the guest room. Fourth of July, 1839. It's done. The orb is assembled. I was awakened by an exhausting nightmare. Shaking and sweating, I retired to the drawing room with a cup of tea. The relic pieces lay spread across the table as I'd left them, but somehow I knew how it was supposed to be. I fetched the tar, which I had prepared to fix the pieces together, and without fault, I joined them, producing the orb I remembered so clearly. The tar proved unnecessary. It was pushed out from the joining pieces as they merged on their own, with no adhesive. The ancient stone relic now rests on my table. Its immaculate surface and perfect shape could have been molded by a factory. This is all too strange. Okay, so now, so you have a possessed orb that decided, well, I'm just going to put myself back together. Get the fuck out of my room. <laughs> Please, for the love of God, just go away. I think he left. He's hunting me! Thank you for making it so obvious. Thank God, there it is. I guess it is a good place to hide it then. Never mind. Yeah! Huzzah! And I've broken that. Alright, let's get the fuck out of here. I have a lot of diary pages in my room, since it's mine, obviously. Let's get the fuck. Oh, fuck. It, this place is just covered. Alright. Oh, right. Yes, Mwaha. Sir William Smith has been marked. Okay. Ah, oh, fucking Christ. This machine room is a little bit too machiney. Fifth of July, eighteen thirty-nine. Today, I went to the university looking for answers. I was able to sneak into Herbert's office and pick up an address book along with some relevant textbooks. Professor Taylor at the Faculty of History was very helpful and I managed to approach the subject of the orbs. The most interesting aspect 
was the prevalent trace they had left in our culture. The mythic orbs may in fact have inspired the Globus Cruciger, which so many royal regalia holds to this day. In ancient times, the orbs were held by priests as a symbol of the sun and its power. As I was leaving, I overheard a disturbing conversation. Sir William Smith, the geologist, was killed last night. Less than a fortnight had passed since I'd asked for his expertise. I know it's silly, but I can't help feeling responsible somehow. Cause you are! <laughs> Oh. Pressure. Uh, there was a note. No, 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 no. No, no, it's diary. Diary. Uh, shut up. Alright. Uh, pressure. Eight up, eight down. Alright. So... Three, six, no. All right, I got. I gotta do some math in my head. So, two, four. No. Uh, vi is six. So three, six, eight. Okay. Wait, whoa, 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 that one, alright, and then that one, okay, so four, so four, seven, think there was anything else over here, was there? Oh, just a bunch of useless boxes. Damn, you slid fast. Fire, even. Okay, not important. July 1839. I've read every book I can find on the subject. While rich in legend and hearsay, my knowledge is lack for the insight I crave. I've sent letters to many in Herbert's address book and received answers of varying importance. Today, I got one which differed greatly from the others. From a baron in Prussia. He said nothing about the quaint stories of priests in underground temples. He didn't even mention them. He simply wrote, I know. I can protect you. Come to Brennenburg Castle. Signed, Alexander. What am I to make of this? Protect me from what? Is someone after me? I looked up Brennenburg and traced it to the Prussian woods near the Baltic Sea. While being the least informative letter I've received, it causes me greatest distress and interest. As I write, my thoughts are drawn to my nightmares in which a most disturbing sound calls to me. A sound defying description. A voice from the void. The last few weeks have been awful, with so many sleepless nights dreading a repeat of those horrid dreams. Tomorrow, I shall visit my physician, Dr. Tate, in hope that he can provide me with sedatives to help me sleep. Okay. Uh, note that 
only two spare rods left in the storage room for the elevator machinery. Make sure to only discard the ones that are badly damaged. Keep the others in the in in the inner study rooms in case all three were would crack again. Uh, okay, so it says it was Trinity Steam Rod. Four phase, and then I think I did it. Let's go downstairs. And then Missing three cogwheels, okay. Black Abyss one. Come here, friend of. There we go. Let's, let's, let's pull out my, uh, friendy here. not seeing any more around here. Let's go back around and see if I can find some somewhere. Upstairs, maybe. Ah, here's one. There we go. Alright, one more. Somewhere! Somewhere. There it is. Ooh. Yay! Christmas is real! Yes! Oh, for fuck's sake. What's this? Nothing in the burner for it to ignite. I'm closing in. Guessing this is what it needs. Maybe I can fit a box in there, get it started. Nope. Because this looks very coalish. Ooh, I'm gonna eat some of my coal for Christmas. Where's my coal, actually? Yeah, I'm actually hungry. Full of coal, okay, so I was right. Now will it work? That's full of coal. Gears are in set. That room has nothing to be done with. Let's let's go back cuz the levers are fine too. Let let's see if the, these were right cuz I probably didn't get a prompt. And I can still collect these. Um.
Ah! There we go! Okay. Uh, I guess. Makes no sense, but whatever. I got it done. It's working. Let's turn this bad boy on. Yes! Yes! Alright. Let's go to the elevator. Oh, for fuck's sake. Ah! What the fuck? It's those things! It's a weird pile of crap. Ah! I passed it! Ah! Get the fuck out of here before I die! A letter frightened him. Oh, that's interesting. Oh, fuck off! Let's just go. Stop somebody from getting in here. Hopefully. Yes! Yes, Professor Taylor was the second death caused by his damn something. Something! God, this isn't gonna end well. This isn't gonna end well. I fucking knew it. Don't. Please. God. 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 Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. No. Going back up. Fuck. Come this way. What was that? Forgive me, I should have warned you. One of my responsibilities as a baron is that of a prison warden. This is where criminals are locked up. Like a dungeon? Very much so. Come. Don't linger. these rocks to move these fuckers about. Yeah! M Man, use rock! Man, use rock! Alright. I figured out how to do it.
No! Oh, I have oil. Never mind. It doesn't matter. Cuts and bruises. Slight headache, so I'm fine now. No! No! Okay, never mind. I didn't no notice that there was a giant pi pile of rubble. I thought somebody was coming. Ugh, rats. Anything? Nothing? Sweet. So towards the noise, or upstairs, where it's completely dark. Let's go towards the noise. Detour! I'm not liking this. Nothing. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Dot, dot, dot. That's my favorite kind of sanity. Yeah. You wanna go, bitch? You wanna fucking go? Too bad! No door! I just want the oil. <laughs> I fucking bit. I mean, the fact that I'm. <laughs> that was weird. Okay. Corroded and weak. Okay. Where is she? Where did she go? <laughs> no. Oh, tell. I'll never tell you. You're just making things worse. Look, this is no place for a young girl all by herself. She could be hurt or worse. There's no telling what horrors await down there. Okay, well, that's fantastic. I was gonna end it, but then I was like, ah, I had, ooh. A chipper.
Please stop. I'm a, I already went insane. I don't need to go. So from worrying about the demon to dealing with the child that is slipping through a hole. Maybe I can, uh, no. Anyways, I, uh, long time ago. Yay! It did work. I'll take it. All that was in here was oil? Really? Wait a minute, do I still- I do! I have an idea! Obviously. There we go. I'm free. Freedom is mine. Storage. Wait a minute. Do not. Okay. Mm 
Kitchen. Storage. Let's go opposite. <gasps> Let's go towards the line. What is that sound? Is he safe? Well, it's for his own good. Awesome. Soon we'll be ready. But there'll be enough time. <laughs> he escaped? Where is he now? Uh <laughs> God damn it. Stupid fucking door. I thought he was outside, that's why I went inside. She deserved it, that little bitch. 2nd of August, 1839. I have arrived at the village of Altstadt. It's a haven in the midst of a vast forest and the last stop before my final destination, Castle Brennenburg. It's late in the evening, and the outrider, who has been with the coach since Bremen, advised me to wait until morning before I venture further. I've arranged for a bed at Der Müller, the village's only inn, and am now waiting for the sun to rise. I try to sleep, but as I close my eyes, I see the men who fell victim in London. My fear and shame forces me to witness the same scenes over and over. They are dead because of me. Awesome. Alright. Uh, as we end this chapter, remember, fuck, <laughs> fuck scary games, fuck this game, fuck all this. This is scary, and I hate scary to death. No, I love scary games. I might, I might complain and say that I hate it, but I don't. And actually, some of the games that I've played, like Mind's Eye and uh, My Last Friday, those were pretty good, because they actually got me. And I was actually creeped out. But, alright. So, thank you guys for watching. Comment, like, and subscribe to the channel. Share the video with your friends on Facebook, Twitter, and any of the social sites that you may have. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Ah! Ah! Bye. Next time. No! Run, run, run! Ah! Uh.